This video is not financial advice. I am not a financial planner. I am an entertainer. I am the one and only ape father in the house, baby. Wow! Okay, so finished the debate with Commander 35. I think that I, in my opinion, I think I was the winner, baby. I was Mike Tyson. I, I feel I won that fight. TKO, baby. Knocked him out, man. But anyway, we'll put that aside. Um, I wanted to give a big shout out to uh, Lord X Nemesis. He made a beautiful, beautiful video on the Eight Folly. He says that I am loved. I am appreciated. Thank you very much. I love you too, brother. Thank you. That that touched the heart. Because that's all the Eight Father wants, baby. I just want to make you all happy. But then he asked another question. He says, are you bipolar? Okay. So uh, got a phone call coming in, but I'll continue. Uh, it's a very popular question. I do get asked that a lot on on uh, on a lot of a lot of levels, you know, <laughs> not just the from the apes, but a lot of my very good friends even ask me that because, you know, it's a combination. I'm Italian, okay, and uh, I was brought up in a very like emotional based family, you know, that sometimes we tend to take things a little too far. You know what I mean? It could be something so stupid. Like one minute, you know, the Italians will be killing each other. You understand? And then uh, the next minute, we're sitting down, we're eating uh, chicken parmesan together. That's just the way we are. You know, we're very, very vocal, very opinionated, very dramatic uh, personalities. But um, this month has been particularly hard for me. You know, we've been dealing with a lot of family issues, a lot. And I just think I got overwhelmed, you know? It just... Between all the, the stress in the stock market, the stress of my the, the family and the challenges. But one thing about me and my wife, we're great parents. No matter what challenges we're facing, we make this time very, very special for our children and also for our dogs. We're big animal lovers. And the children, you know, we, we're taking them, you know, to Smithville. And, you know, we're taking them to all, uh, you know, the, the, the Christmas attractions. Like I said, I took my, my son recently to Dyker Heights in Brooklyn and... You know, we're doing a lot for the kids. It's a wonderful, wonderful Christmas for them, and they're very happy. Um, but it's been a challenging month just in terms of a lot of stress, family stress, stock stress. And I, again, apologize to the Ape family. You you didn't see the best of the Ape Father this month. You, you you probably saw me at my my worst time. You probably saw me at my, you know, most downtime this month. And I know you dealt with a lot of stuff from me, <laughs> you know. I, I did a lot of crazy videos. I tend to uh, do something I shouldn't do. When I'm not feeling like myself and I'm down in the dumps, I sometimes make videos. Like most people don't do that. But I, I like to keep, you know, it's funny. I like to keep my videos real. You know, I really do. Like, you know, so if I'm, if I'm angry, I express that, you know. If I'm happy and I'm in my happy place, I express that. If I'm sad, I express that. But sometimes people, you know, who are my followers, who want me to be their inspiration, they want me to keep them motivated, keep them feeling happy. If I'm not happy, <laughs> you know, and I'm not, you know, being positive, I realize that that could actually be a negative effect. And again, I apologize for that, sincerely. Um, I'm going to definitely, I'm feeling better. I'm feeling a lot better. You know, I have a lot of great conviction in AMC. We're all going to be rich, in my opinion, okay? We're all going to be millionaires. We're going to just hold with diamond balls of steel. We're going to make it, and we're going to be so happy. We're going. To, this is the greatest opportunity, AMC, in the history of our lives. It's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity for generational wealth. And that's it. It's coming. We're all going to, we're all going to look back on all these tough times one day when we got our Lamborghinis, where we got, you know, our Ferraris, our Bentleys, our mansions, maybe even Ape Island. <laughs> That's the Ape Father's dream, to party with all my apes on our, on our own personal island. Um, we're going to look back and say, you know what? We did it. We, 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 we beat the hedge funds. We beat the corruption. We beat the odds. It's like that song with Phil, Phil, Phil Collins, Against the Odds, you know? How could I walk away from AMC? I'll never leave without a trace, right? When the apes were faced with pressure, we spit in Ken Griffin's face. Cause the apes are the only one who's got diamond balls of steel at all. We do, okay? And then take a look at us now. 
when that Moaz happens, when all our dreams are going to come true, it's going to be absolutely fantastic. So Lord X Nemesis, thank you for that video that I am loved and appreciated. I love and appreciate you. I love and appreciate all my ape family and forgive me for not being myself this month. You're going to see much, much better videos of the ape father. I threw in that piano man video. That was, that was me going back to my old self, baby. And you're going to see a lot more of videos like that. Okay. If you, uh, Actually, if you haven't seen that video, check it out. So search for Ape Father. Is Ape Father, you know, leaving YouTube? And I threw in a, a great rendition of Piano Man by Billy Joel. But my own words, my own lyrics. <laughs> Have a wonderful night. Good night. Bono note in Italian. Ciao. The Ape Father loves you.